Yeah, yeah, yeah. For the day short, this is what we got going on. I'm over here in the backyard again. You know how I do. Whenever I got free time on my hand, I'll be trying to come back here and keep it together. But if you don't take care of it, boy, it will oh, go to nothing. But, yeah, so I'm back here getting everything. I had already started, you feel me, that whole little side over there. I had got that side together a little bit. Then I was like, damn, I'm tripping. Let me get the video camera and record. Man, what I'm doing? Let the people see what it is. So, as you see, I'm getting it together. I ain't do too much cleaning up, you feel me? I just really tried to organize it the way I could have enough space to have it clean, a clean area for it. Yeah, you see all them weeds and stuff I was trying to get up out of there. But we finna plant some corn, man. I know I I, I know it was I, I I realized it wasn't the smartest idea at the end. You're gonna see why, but you feel me? We're gonna see what it do. Hopefully it do something. I put I put a whole bunch of them too, cause um, from what I learned from with this 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 this, this uh gardening stuff with certain plants, you feel me? You gotta put a couple seeds in there and if if you if you just so you can expect something out of it, you feel me? You can't be expect you can't be planting one seed somewhere and expecting something out of that. It just don't work. And a lot of that go with life and all, but a, gar a lot of garden stuff go with life, but it's real, yo. You gotta plant you a couple seeds in the area for some stuff to really take off and grow, cause not all of them gonna make it. Animals, birds, animals, birds, but yeah, stuff be getting to them. A little credit be getting them, you feel me? But yeah. Cleaning it all up. It looked good. It's starting to look a little better. You feel me? It was way worse. I wish I would have caught it before. I think I did catch it before video. If I'm not mistaken, I think I did catch it before video. I got to check that. But how? Yeah, you see it. But yeah, yeah, watch it though. The whole just break on me. <laughs> Well, it wasn't yet, yeah, but that, the whole broke on me, bro. It's going to happen eventually, long, longer down in the video. But see, I had to get them scissors there. Snip, snip, you know what I'm saying? All in the way. It was so many weeds and stuff over there trying. But that's what happens when you don't take care of the backyard. Yo, if you let it go for a little too long, a month, you got work on your hands, my guy. Man, I, I don't like a dirty yard. Yo, that joint is hell. I like my yard clean. You feel me? Everything in the yard, I did it too. From that bird house right there, y'all see, to the turf style joint for the dogs. The whole little pathway with the, 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 the center block joint. I said center block, but the pavers. Yeah, I did all that. Shit, I, I think I got video of it. I might upload it, you know what I'm saying, if I find it. But, yeah, sturdy. Y'all get the picture. I'm a handyman that back up. It's all good though. It broke on me, man. It be like that sometimes. <laughs> Why did I give me another one too? Really did. 
cleaning up all the, I mean, uh, chopping up all the dirt so that it's real soft under there, so there ain't no real places where it could be any more roots or anything, any weeds under there. I'm mad the whole kept breaking, but it is what it is. Still got sturdy and got it done. Jones, aggravating boy. Real player though, we get it still, we get sturdy still. Don't let it stop the show, but now I'm just even the dirt out now. I'ma just make sure I just even it out as much as possible. I don't like when it be too hot up in the front up there, so I push it back. So like when it rain or so, it don't be all saturated back there with the birds and stuff falling in they stuff. You see the bird popped up too. I ain't even look at them popped up. On the racing pigeons, I ain't really been doing too much with them. They just been doing their thug back there, chilling. But I don't be wanting to mess the area up for real too much. Man, this whole area used to be the area, but I ended up knocking it down because it was just too much where it was cleaning wise and stuff in the wood and all that. And you got it's ways you got. I, I, I did a lot of stuff, but I also learned a lot from it too. You feel me? So that's a good thing. So when I do it again, you feel me? We'll redo some other type time because I want to do some other stuff. Chickens, all that you heard. Yeah, stay tuned though. All that's gonna come. I don't be playing with it. Cleaning them up real good, you know. That's the little uh, mulch pile we gonna see. Definitely gonna use it for some, um, like a little fertilizer pile. Put some fruits and stuff in there and get sturdy with it. So I'm done with that now. See, we got the little corn seeds here. The corn seeds is really pieces of corn, yo. It's crazy. So all you gotta do, shave a corn, drop it in there. I don't know if it gotta be dried out or not, but yeah, shave it, drop it in there. Look, I'ma show them to you. It's really corn seed, yeah. This the part I realized where I forgot the birds was here, so me dropping them wasn't wouldn't be so much of a good idea. But shit, only way I'ma know is if I try and find out. But that's why I drop a lot of them too when I plant them. I drop the whole bunch of them. I ain't even hold back. Drop the whole bag for real. So hopefully something shake out of there, and then you know the more that it, that it grow. Dude, they're going to be falling off into the ground, you feel me? Some of them falling off, just making more. It's a DIY stuff, man. It's nothing too serious. All, everything's DIY. It's just for fun, really, you know? Stuff I like to do. Keep my mind going, you know what I'm saying? I like trying stuff. I know it's a season for corn and all that, but you know, we live in South Florida. So we gonna try to see what we could do with it. You see all of them dropping everything. Droppy, droppy, droppy. Drop the whole bag. Now I'm gonna cover it up. I patted it a little bit, but then <laughs> the whole broke again. So I just used the bottom part. It got all the dirt over it. Then I just patted it down. At first I was using that, but then I was like, yeah, that's not, a, that's not gonna work. So then I went and got the um the hand um thing I forgot what it's called. Y'all gonna see it though. Cause I couldn't do that no more. That was it. It wasn't doing it wasn't covering no land, it wasn't covering no space. Went and got the hand one, you feel me? Soft taps, nothing too hard, just soft taps so the dirt will be over it. 
found this root. Get that root up out of there. Come on, man. Messing up the veggies. Sturdy, sturdy. You know what I'm saying? And that's how you plant that corn, baby. Then we're going to hit it with a little water. Not too much, you know, but something, though. You feel me? Just got to wet the ground around it. We ain't going to do too much water. Cause I know you ain't supposed to do too much water with the corn. You want the bacteria and everything to fertilize. I should have I grew a few, a few of them in, in a bag or something before I did it. But we're going to do it, and we're going to see what happens. I just thank y'all for watching, whoever watches, you know. Enjoy the journey. You know, next week I'm going to come back. And the time goes on, I'm going to come back with more videos, more videos. Just show the growth. Because we definitely got bananas, papayas, sugar cane, all type of stuff. I even got an avocado tree growing over there. So, yeah, man. Check us out. We get sturdy. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe, comment, the whole nine, y'all. Keep me going in there. Keep me going when I know y'all watching it. For sure.